Good morning, dogs. Today is an important day in American history. On September 11, 2001, four airplanes were hijacked by 19 terrorists. Two planes were flown into the World Trade Center in New York City. As people rushed out of the towers, many rushed in to help, including firefighters and police officers who saved thousands of lives. Almost 3,000 people were killed, including 441 first responders in total. 23 years later, this is still the biggest terrorist attack in American history. Now, if you could all join me and our crew in a moment of silence. Thank you. And now for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. There is a t-shirt fundraiser for Best Buddies. Shirts from small to extra large are $14 and two times extra large and four times extra large are $18. If you want to order one, you can place your order in the bookstore or with one of the Best Buddies members. Money is due at the time of ordering. Orders are due by October 1st. Reminder that there will be a Science Olympiad call-up meeting during homeroom Thursday, September 19th in Miss Hammond's room 149. Art Club and Photo Club will hold a combined call-out meeting Thursday in room 150. Any student interested in being part of either or both clubs is invited to this meeting. See Miss Buckingham, Urum, or Ms. Caesar if you have questions. Now sitting it to Padilla with sports. Thanks, Farley. And for sports, we have last night's boys tennis match results. The Frankfurt Hot Dog boys tennis team improved their record to, from 4-3 with a win over Southmont. Jackson Ray won his first match at one singles in two sets. Kelby Santos is in a six-game winning streak with a win in two singles. One double team of Isai Jimenez and Charlie Beardsley played well and won their match 6-1 and 6-2. Their next match is at home versus Lebanon tomorrow at 4.30. So come out and support your dogs. And now for boys soccer. The boys soccer team handed Faith Christian their first non-win of the season with a 1-1 tie. Caesar Alanis scored Frankfurt's lone goal in the first half with an assist from Dylan Acosta. Sebastian Aguilar Espinoza kept the team in the game with 15 saves until the penalty kick was called with one minute left in the second half. They faced Crawfordsville at home Thursday night, so be sure to pop out and support the dogs. And for today's sports, we have girls bar soccer away and for uh, against Faith Christian and girls volleyball away against Tri-West. That's all for sports and now sending it to Jaden with weather. <coughs> Right, thanks, Alyssa, and good morning, dogs. It was pretty warm coming in this morning with it being 56 and winds only at 3 miles per hour. And it will be more hot coming out of school later with it being 85 and sunny all day. And the low will only be 54. Well, that will be all for me, dogs, and now sending it back to your host. Thanks, Jaden. Just a reminder that tomorrow there's a crash meeting during homeroom and collaboration space one. The hot dog challenge is back. Each team must consist of three girls and three boys. One person from each team must fill out the Google form from Ms. Mowdy in your email. Forms must be submitted by this Friday, September 13th. The hot dog challenge will take place on Sunday, September 22nd at 4 p.m. on the football field. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Mowdy or Mr. Taylor. The math department will be beginning offering free math help on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 3 to 4.15 in room 102. For lunch today, in lines one and two is meatball subs, and line three and four is sausage links and fish toast. A big happy birthday goes to Javier Delgado, Mar Marisol Hernandez, Abigail Mitcham, and Heidi Valdez. And that's all from us. Have a good doggy day. <laughs>